Arsenal remain interested in trying to sign Mikel Moreno. We saw him during the Euros. He played seven matches, only started against Albania, I think, but was impressive in that tournament. And Arsenal are continuing to explore the details around a potential deal to try to sign him. So there's been no formal approach just yet. 28 years of age, so a slightly different profile from what Arsenal have been doing in recent time when it comes to some of their transfer business. He's entered the final year of his contract as well, so similar to Conor Gallagher in that respect. So he's got a number of options that he's looking at at the moment. He's one of a number of players Arsenal are looking at in this transfer window. And we've heard from Mikel Arteta in the last few days. He said, don't expect anything like a £100 million signing of Declan Rice, which they did last summer. But they did say, crucially, they will look to strengthen if they can. And Mourinho would be someone who would add to their stocks in midfield. OK. Uh, Mark, just tell us a little bit more about it. I mean, Newcastle fans might know a bit about him because obviously he was there for a little while. What will they be getting if they add to their already impressive midfield that Mikel Arteta has been building over the last few years? Well, they're getting a player that's just won the Euros uh, and played a part He's in all a winner, seven games number one. for Spain. Yeah. And I think if you look at any kind of criticism for Arsenal over the last few years, whilst they've been absolutely brilliant, they've played great football, they've got young, exciting players, they're clearly on a good journey the one thing they haven't been able to do is get over the line and put some silverware in the cabinet. Whereas this is a player that can absolutely done that because he's just proven it with Spain. <laughs> I think one of the key things about Marino as well is he brings a real versatility to that midfield. He can play as a six, as a pivot, can also play as a left-sided eight. Uh, he can play as an advanced midfielder. So he can play in multiple roles as well which I think would be a key thing for Mikel Arteta, someone that can play there in different positions. And James touched upon it. He's got that experience as well at 28 years old. He goes against the grain slightly of what Arsenal have done over the last few transfer windows. A little bit more experience, a little bit more know-how and knowledge. But when you look at the potential trade-off, Emil Smith-Rowe, quality player heading to Fulham, if you could replace him with another midfielder like Marino, I think that would be a real statement of intent. Mm. And you add that to Calafiori, maybe a striker, and you'd say Arsenal, on paper right now, could be the team to beat this season the Premier League. Yeah.